Well, that's annoying. I can't claim it because it's already been claimed, but it's still bouncing. It glitched. Uh, hi. Uh, episode one. Here we go. Let's, um... I don't know what's in this. Party, team, don't care, don't care. Sure, how about that? That'll give us a nice chat that doesn't actually. That's fine, I don't wanna change this, it's on the main PC. All right, here we go. Uh, what do we got to work with? Lots of uh, contribution XP. Cool. Uh, I haven't played for a few days, but I'm starting now. What else? What gear do we have? It looks like we have a weapon or two. Uh, it's fine. One durability gone because of the tutorial. Um, so starting off, still at 66. I'm really moved. There's some daily stuff. Let's collect some of this junk. Um, what else? Aggression pass. This is going to be where a lot of my silver comes from to begin with. Okay, so I'm playing Shy. Uh, we got to avoid combat. So the awakening quest line on Shy, uh, I know, doesn't have any combat. Uh, plus, we get a boost in. Um,. Alchemy and, and gathering, so that gives us a little bit of boost on life fame since we're we're um, life fame level locked in <laughs> in the uh, region. We kind of need that. Um, really, I need a silver making plan. So life tools first, and I need to get safe. So let's run to a safe zone, and then I gotta go to Olvia. <clears throat> PvP won't be a problem for a while. What does this guy want? We'll do quest up until it requires me to kill stuff. Venture manual. Sure. What is a venture manual? Come on. <clears throat> care about the adventure board but <sighs> humans can ride sure how about that I don't think we I don't know what that is I couldn't tell shark why do, why do we need this whatever off we go um let's go to Western guard camp, but first there's a guy up here that I want to talk to this node I don't care about the traces All right Zoom is zoom. Uh, I'm not gonna cut anything out. There's gonna be so much happening in the first I don't know uh, 20 30 Minutes that um, I kind of just want to record and talk and go. So I can't kill anything. So butcher knife and tanning knife are off the table, but I need all the other life tools. I am going to need a life skill accessory set. going to need a fishing rod. I'm uh, going to need a riding crop. I'm going to have to figure out mount uh, stuff. Most of that stuff is given to you through doing quests and stuff um so that may be a problem uh, really i'm gonna be resource gated um but i want to just i just want to talk to some people see if i can't get max energy up why is all this up here Get out of here. Um... Greetings. I'm Luke from Velia. I don't 
remember that as a thing. Sure, we can spend three energy and gain knowledge on that. Why not? Stable keepers are going to be good. What do we start at? We got zero silver. The arms dealer. This is what I want to see. Militia weapon, maybe. We might be able to get some, like, just base stuff. I don't know. Also, I've been reading comments. Fishing is not killing. It doesn't increase the monster kill count. The only thing that I'm going off of is the monster kill count. Uh, defeated monsters, so. Alright, we need to make some progress here. I need... Let me talk to all the village uh, people around here just to um, unlock some stuff and get all these question marks off here and maybe get some knowledge and I'll, uh, I'll cut back. Okay, that's done. We got a couple of max energy out of that. We need to auto sprint. We need our sprint to go up. So running everywhere is going to be good until I figure out what kind of amount I want to deal with. Um... I'm gonna talk to anybody along the way. This is Blainer's Western Gateway. That I can, so that I can get max energy, because 52 energy is not doing it for me. I'm gonna need a whole heck of a lot more than that. I am on my way to Olvia. Uh, I want to set up in between Olvia and over here in uh, Velia. Uh, Olvia is around in this area, so I'm on my way over there. Uh, while I do that, I'm going to talk a little bit about uh, the plan. So, since I'm uh, region and central market locked, uh, I'm kind of piddling around here. I'm going to be in this low level area until I can get some experience and level up. And then get some actual proper DP gear so I don't get myself killed running around. Uh, so I think it's best to stay around Olvi and Velia. Until I kind of get established and then if i need to i can pack up all my cp and all my storage and crap and, and move it but for now i need to get to where i can kind of support myself with just training books and like the afk training books to get some experience while i'm not there i can set it up on the second computer and let it afk fish i know some people are going to be a little upset about that but as long as it doesn't increase the monster kill count, that's what I'm going for. Alanos River. Cool. We're getting there. Running with the map open is probably not a good idea on an account where I can't die. Otherwise, I, I lose. So, I need to pay more attention. Uh, but anyway, and then I think what I'm going to do is just kind of stick around Olvia for a little bit until I can get the base tools and then... Probably focused on herb gathering around the uh, Serene Springs over there in the Balasmos Mountains. That's going to be... That's probably going to be... Uh, herb gathering is going to get my start. Maybe... Maybe the farm over here around Olvia. I can do some like milk gathering and stuff. But... Where, who do I got to talk to to unlock... Stuff on the map here. We got this priestess lady... Oh, come on. We don't care about the cutscene. Cool. There's that. Uh, let me do the node manager so I can actually see on the map. Cool. Cost of farm. And we need to go on up here for Olvia. Whoops. So, I think the cost of farm. I think the cows that you milk are like right around here somewhere. I can't remember. It's been so long. Eh, I don't want to accidentally hit a bug. Those little grass beetles or whatever they are are a little, a little scary, but there is a uh, place to milk cows over here. I'm pretty sure it's around Casta Farm. Maybe it's the other farm I need to um, watch out for. We'll talk to a few. Let me talk to everyone around here in Olvia, and then I'll, um, I'll pick it back up. Okay, I got most of the guys around Olvia. There's a couple of guys still left. 
around here that I got to talk to, but I'll run into them. I checked while I was at the material vendor. I need 55 silver to buy just a base hoe. So we're going to go out here and see if I can't do some wilder barehanded gathering and get... Some fairy powder. Shouldn't take too long, right? If I have to, I'll sell these herbs on the uh, central market since central market is allowed. Oh, kefir stone. Cool. Um, it'd be nice to get 10 of these done. We need fairy powder, ancient spirit dust. We need to make kaffirs, we need to get potatoes. There should be a potato around here somewhere. I think there's a potato farm. I'll have to look it up because I can't remember the exact locations of a lot of these farms. But we're going to keep going until I get some fairy, fairy dust. Hey look, we're already level 2. Good stuff. I don't know if I can get fairy dust barehanded. I think I can, but it's probably just low level. There's one. Um, 10,000 silver. Good enough. We're off to the races. Um, the other thing that I have, so for this, I wanted to establish a base of operations, which I kind of think it's going to be around Olvia for now. My leveling methods are going to be AFK training books and uh, just through gathering, maybe uh, AFK fishing. But uh, this episode is going to run a little bit longer because I want to get at least some accessories um from for loggy accessories we gotta go back up here to the mat vendor general goods i can't remember where he is it's been so long since i've hung out in Olvi. i usually hang out in, in uh heidel on the on the wizard all right we that's not the guy that i need i did need the material vendor where are they at Transport, weapons, armor, furniture, jewelry. Is it not listed here? It's a joke hard to understand. Good storage. Was back up there where I thought it was. What's wrong with me? I'll get to where I cut some of this more boring, mundane stuff out once. Once we get later on into the series, but I want to no sell this, and I guess we'll buy a hoe for now. Unless, do we have, we can get a dream horse. I'm going to leave that in there for now. I'm going to allow it. Uh, the Composha stuff, <clears throat> I will also pick up later on. The loyalties are good to get. Some of this other stuff, though. We could get this. I don't know if I should allow uh, the free stuff or not. The demi... You know what? <clears throat> I'm going to. I did it the hard way. I got a hoe. Now I have one that's unlocked. We're going to take the hoe. Because these are finite, they will... They'll go away in two weeks if I don't use them all, but you can't repair them. So, that's also going to help me level up faster. So, what we're going to do is we're going to get out here and gather some herbs. I shouldn't need very much in terms of I don't think I need to run all the way to the springs yet what I really want it's a potato farm but I can't remember where it's at around here okay let me find where I'm going I need to look up and see if I can't remember. Give me a minute. I'll be back. Okay, so I need to focus on this progression pass because I need 
I need a couple hundred million silver, basically, from this. So I need to get ten of these done. Uh, and as I'm doing that level up, that way I can kind of uh, get the accessories I need from Logia. So we're going to have to go to Logia because I need potatoes, fairy powder, ancient spirit dust, and a capper stone. That'll get me four done. I also need rough stone and logs. And then I can do polished stone, so that'll put me up to seven. And eight, and I already got one done. And then weasel blood I'm not going to be able to do... Fairy's Breath. That should be fine. Can't do Fox Hide. Can't do Fire Horn. I can do Scooping Water. Scooping Water and Purified Water would be fine. And I can milk a cow. So we're going to go to... First off, I'm going to go talk to this guy down here. Then I'm going to run back to the mat vendor. Let's see if this guy actually sells what I need. Get out of here. Skip the cutscene. Yes, he does. Um, buy multiple. I can get like, what, three, four. We'll get five of those. We'll scoop some water when I go buy water. Uh, but we're headed for Logia Farm, which is like here. And then out this way. It's like right out here somewhere. So let's talk to this guy. We're gonna jump off this cliff. And we're gonna take. We are gonna need an axe. And we're also gonna need a pickaxe. Whoops. X. We're going to have to get 10 logs. So we're going to lumber. That'll give us some XP, and I'm just going to do this on the way. So I'm going to do this. I'll run to the wharf manager and keep logging logs along the way there, and I'll pick it back up after I hit log it for him. You know, I think for the sake of... Doom, Danae, I don't know, female. Isn't the male the harder one to get? Sure. I love how they had to add in thing to where you just... <laughs> because people can't read. Enter the following word for word. Alright, so the reason uh, I want to do that is for... It's for the sake of being able to run around fast so that whenever I cut things out, I'm not sitting here for hours on end traveling, uh, making the video boring. I mean, I should have done that back whenever we were up at Olvia, but I'm going to, I'm not running back up there. I want to go to the wharf manager. It's out there. And then I want to go on to Velia. And I'll unlock it there, and then I can get around a little bit better. Uh, I did... I'll turn that stuff off the UI as soon as I can. I can't do it till level 10. Um, I did get enough logs and enough um, stone to complete the little progression pass thing. So we'll be doing that here in a minute. But I'm just trying to up my energy. I'm up to 54. 54 right now. And we are... A th two-thirds of the way to level four which is pretty good being that I haven't killed anything yet hang out here at the coast for a minute not to drown or take any damage don't want to die and end the run here no real important reason for talking to him other than um, max energy. Okay, so I'm going to have to run to a... There's no way around it. I'm going to have to go to the stable keeper. I'll catch you guys when I'm back over there. Still got some travel time, but I was thinking about some stuff. Um, 
there are a couple of key quests that I need to get done. I got to do the Liana's tool bag. Uh, that is going to be high on my list of things to do probably in the next couple of episodes. Uh, I don't know what it entails. It's been forever since I did it. So, yeah, we're going to have to... I got to find it. This. I'm going to talk to Liana. Guess the answer. Oh, it's just a trivia, so I'll do that whenever I get value. Uh, then we won't have to worry about inventory space for the tool bag we can just put it on and go the other thing is the green thumb quest i gotta find my way to land a morning light now this is where i'm going to turn it to you all is it cheating if i get my wizard on the other account and uh my carrick and boat myself to land of the morning light let me know i mean technically i guess it could be i could swim but i'm never gonna make it I'm never going to make it across Morgoria by swimming. Um, I'll get killed or drown or something. The other option is to try to boat myself there. And the more realistic option is taking ferries. Uh, leaving at the wharf over there that we unlocked. The Olvia Wharf here and going to Ilya Island, which is way out here. Wherever it's at. Um, I think it's like out here. And then ferrying all the way up here. Um, let me know. Because I can't use the Magnus. There, There's no way for me to use the Magnus. I, I can unlock some things, but there's going to be kill quests in there, so I'm not going to be able to unlock it. And I don't want to attempt it and get stuck. Alright. What are we going to name this thing? Powder. Because we're on the hunt for fairy powder. Alright. Now we have a little bit better way of going. We need to go... That's Crown Castle. We need to go like... Here. To Logia Farm, I think. This thing has all the skills, right? Yeah. Perfect. This is much better. And we're getting uh, training levels by riding this thing around, and we're gaining actual combat levels. So, I will probably first off be training this guy to as high level as I possibly can. Um, that way, monsters don't attack him, and I can leave him wherever, because I don't have a... Oh no, we don't want to go up here. That's not a good idea. That's how I get myself in in bad shape. Um, Ultra Vagar, so we need to go further this way. Get ourselves to log the farm. Ooh, beginner training, beginner five. Here we go, log the farm. This is where I want to be. Talk to that guy. We need to go talk to the logia lady. This lady's going to be our best friend for quite a while. Um, this lady here. The sea defender. So this is where all my life skilling stuff's gonna be coming from. Right here. We got a riding crop that we need. We got some luggy accessories. Uh, and then straight off, uh, gatherer's clothes gonna give some DP. I might end up wearing, um, the hunter's clothes later on. They give quite a bit too. But, uh, then we're gonna have, once our pickaxe uh hoe and axe runs out then we'll buy them from here uh fluid collector will be good processing stone is going to be essential but the tanning knife and the butcher knife are a no-go and then of course the mastery clothes maybe some seeds too but uh first off we have to get potatoes so we're going to run down here until we pick some potatoes there's some Potatoes. Potatoes. Now, I don't mind recording like an hour long episode. That doesn't bother me at all. Uh, the. It's just whether y'all want to watch it or not. Um, and if you prefer shorter, where I cut most every 
thing out. I mean, I'm trying to cut out some of the boring mundane stuff unless I have something to talk about, but uh, I figure these first few episodes, there's going to be a lot of stuff. You're going to want to see exactly how I get started, get going. Let's see, we need, where's the potato one I was looking for? Ten potatoes, we need a few more. We're at like six, I think. Yeah, we need four more potatoes. Get the taters. All right, can this thing go off my screen now? Cool. Um, let's finish what we can. We get this, this, this. We're gonna need more fairy powder and ancient dust, and we're gonna need to scoop some water. These last things we'll uh, deal with later. We need fairy powder and ancient spirit dust and black gem fragments okay so water scooping is gonna be next let's go get the horsey and go to the water where is the closest river so we can just go right over here to Belia and while we're while we're over there we could do the um, Liana's tool bag if I can remember what the quiz answers are I don't like to zoom around all right let's do I'm fishing Yes, a fishing rod, but fishing we rod. are going to need... Kriya will give you one. Sure, hush, hush, you can have that. Uh, we're going to need silver before we do that. So, I already got the bottles. We're going to water scoop. And then water filter. We're almost out of inventory slots already, so that's a thing. I'll let this first one fill up, and then we will... We'll cut the rest of it out. Alright, I'll be back. Alright, so I realized I'm an idiot. Um, okay. I won't complain. What am I supposed to do for the Floramos? Okay, so I just need uh, byproducts for gathering, cooking, whatever. Um, that's fine. What do I need to do for tool bag? Uh, I was gathering. Oh, I need to be a certain level, right? To unlock this. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I don't have to do main quest to unlock the Black Spirit. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay, so that's from level 49, so I can't do that anyway yet. Uh, but anyway, I realized that they wanted me to gather river water, not ocean water. So I kind of wasted my time sitting there gathering. So we're going to buy five more bottles. Uh, this is another thing that I wanted to, to touch on. The loggia stuff you can buy here. At 1.5 mil, it's convenient. But if you go to Logia Farm, it's only 1 mil. Um, so I recommend going to Logia Farm. I can't talk to any of those guys yet. I guess I'll run over here to the river. This is the closest river. For now. And I can't leave. I can't leave Balanos, so I can't go to Heidel yet. Kind of picked to set up my my node. I don't have anything in storage or node network set up here, so I technically I can wander to a new region. I don't have anything active here right now, um, but I'm gonna set up in Balanos for a little bit because the my go-to silver and like progress making is gonna be horse training right now. I don't want to spend my silver on, like, what little bit of silver I get from Fairy Powder and then from the Progression Pass. I don't want to spend that on 
fishing rods that I throw away. So I'm going to wait until I can get a Balanos fishing rod. Uh, I can't buy anything. Well, actually, level 5, I can't. Um, <sighs> so... I need to put... I put this in the last... Um, I can buy life tools off of the um, marketplace. So now I have access to the enhancement tab and the life tool tab now. So I could buy a fishing rod, but I want a Balanos rod. Uh, I'm probably going to have to craft my own. I would prefer to have it level 10, but we'll see. Um, there's a lot of orders in there, but I would like to save up. I guess I shouldn't be just sitting. I should actually actively be doing something. Um, let me see if it'll let me water scoop from here. Please try again in a moment. Can't use this item. It's on cooldown. Can't use this item. What? Okay. 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 Let me back up. I say, how long does the bottle stay on cooldown? It's just a freaking bottle. Uh, but anyway, I can buy that stuff off the market now. Since I'm level 5, I have the actual life tools unlocked. And then at level 10, armor unlocks. But I don't want to... I don't want to start fishing too early. Because I want to be able to... Get a good fishing rod. You know, I could go buy regular fishing rods from the vendor. But I think it's going to be more beneficial if I just... If I just wait... All right, give us one more bottle of water. We'll be done with that. Let's see if I can purify this stuff right here. What's the progression pass want? So we got... We got the water, right? So we need to use chopping. And I ended up turning in 20 stone to uh, the blacksmith while I was uh, cut away there. So I'm probably going to have to get some more stone to make rough stone. I need 10. Um, where are you at? I need 10 bottles of water, so I'll come back. I'll do that off camera. Um, I've got two. I think it's one to one at this mastery, so I'm going to need three more anyway. So I'll get that sorted. I'm going to clear out the inventory, and then I'll meet you back. I need to gather some stone on my way out because I don't have any, and then I need to make some scantling. So I have my uh, test cut out for me. I'll pick it back up after I got some of these chores done, and we'll see where I get to. Okay, I think I have everything that I need to do some damage to the, uh... We're gonna put a dent in this, uh, daunting progress bar here. We're gonna have to process some stuff, so first thing we gotta do is do some choppy choppy. Uh, I'm gonna save all this iron ore that I got from mining rocks. Because... I'm gonna need it for cooking utensils. Uh, there's one other thing. If you made it this far, uh, 33 minutes in, yeah, I'll ask it now. I think... I mentioned this in the introduction... Um, does it count if I'm in a party with somebody? I know it doesn't increase the monster count, so technically it's legal, but it feels like I'd be cheating if I went and, uh, basically got in a party, had somebody else kill the monsters, and then butchered them, or tanned them. I, I feel, I feel like that's cheating. Um, and then we need to filter this, right? This should almost get me to where... Cool. And I did level up from riding horse. Alright, so we got this. Oh, I need 10 purified water. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. I'm gonna have to do that all. I got this one. This one. That's at 7. It'll put me at 8. If I can get 10 fairy powder, that'll put me at 9. 
Can't do any of those. I could go milk a cow. Black gems are going to have to wait. That one will be, that will put me at eight. And these are all going to have to wait. So that'll put me at eight. I need to finish filtering while I talk. Uh, so let me know if you think that would be cheating too. Um, if I was to just follow somebody around butchering. Because if it's not cheating and you guys agree with it, maybe I'll just get my wife to go kill some monsters and I'll just follow her around and butcher them. It gets meat. Um, but if not, I understand. Because I, I kind of feel like it's cheating. Um, so I'm not going to do it until clarified. But, but I have my path forward. Uh, I'm going to horse train a lot. I need to find horse uh, capture location in Balanos. I don't know if there is one. If there isn't, then I'm going to have to move to Heidel. I also need to know where to milk cows in Balanos. Video, uh, milk cow Balanos. Where? Video, dairy farm locations. I need to know. I need to know nodes. No, 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 no. I need to know where they're at. Ooh, there we go. Cow locations. Whale farm. Okay. I thought so. So I'm going to have to spend some time. In whale. I'm going to have to go up to whale farm. So that's where I will head. The dog barking in the background if you hear him. Sorry this is taking so long. Actually, we did get purified water. Okay, cool. So there's that. Uh, I'm going to set up in Balanos, I know for sure, for the... Uh, uh, I don't want to waste energy on that. Okay. Can I actually... No, I can't. So I'll have to do the Magnus for that. Um, stuff I don't need... I'm going to need iron ore. Silver, probably not. Gold is going to be valuable. Um, potatoes are going to be valuable. Rough stone, scantling is going to be valuable. Kaffirs will be. The rest of this stuff is going to the central market. Until I run out of weight. Nope, that's iron. I'm going to need you. Just a second. I'll do this and I'll come back when I'm over at Whale Farm. Oh, we're going to level up. I know I said I'd come back at Whale Farm, but we're about to level up the horsey. And we discovered Coastal Cliff. That's nice. There we go. Level the horsey. Ooh, discovered new areas. Mining. Um, oh, we got a life box. Cool. As soon as I get 10 fairy powder and milk a cow, I'm going to actually have more than a life box. Oh, that's another thing while I'm sitting here. Um, get rid of these titles. I don't care about them right now. I need to keep collecting these. Uh, the composers can wait. Don't care. That stuff might be useful. This will probably... These things will probably be useful. Um, I'll do them as I can because the seals are going to be useful. But what I'm really looking for... An alchemy tool, another alchemy tool, another alchemy, because I reached um, high alchemy, so not, none of that is is really that useful, but what I'm looking for, the support box, that gives me more um, inventory, and of course we've got uh, some scrolls and stuff here, oh look, 3 million silver from logging in, cool, we'll collect that too, uh, the other thing is going to be Black Spirits Adventure, I'm pretty much just going to roll this when I can. Uh, all the rewards help. Yes, auto roll. Just just roll like crazy. Get it done. Nobody likes this. Ooh, warm black tea. That'll help later on. Maybe I can uh, turn that on and, and horse train my way to level 20 with that. Alright, we're getting close. 
last I found the cow farm. We gonna milk a cow. Success. Okay, now I have to get fairy powder. I hope 27 energy is enough. Um, I think... What I want to do is go to the herbs, which is in the Balanos Mountains. So let me get over there. I'll check back in. I want to get the Logia gear done before I end this off. It's coming up on like the 45 minute mark, which is where I kind of wanted to cut it off. So let me start cutting some stuff out and get some progress done. I'm not going to be able to set up a node network because I need to do some contribution point grinding. Basically, I need to do some uh, gathering missions and stuff, life skill stuff. But I need to get to level 10 so I can turn on. I guess I need to get to level 20. Uh, but I want the life stuff, the fishing stuff, the trade stuff. I don't want combat or main story quest on. So I'm going to have to uh, get to where I can turn that stuff off. And let's see. Let me do this. As long as I'm in the blue area, I'm fine. That is the guard camp. That's Velia. I should be, as long as I stay over here, I should be fine. I think that should be fine to go to. Um, let me... Let me get over there. We'll figure it out. Alright, I'm over here in the spring. It's going to take me a while, I think, but uh, I'm going to get five more fairy powder and we should be good. Hopefully 28 energy is enough. I don't know, but we're going to try. Um, I'll pick it back up whenever I'm over. Whenever I'm on the other side of the, the fairy powder grind. So, uh, see you in a bit. Okay, uh, I'm back over here at Logia. I believe we have enough to get 10. Yes. Now, I've got these. I may have to run to the storekeeper. Gosh dang it. Back on a mission. Good thing I got the Pegasus, huh? leveling training very quickly to currency exchange yay cool 200 mil just like that okay, so that means episode one is a success and of course we are going to work towards 50 goals now because easy early game silver these, uh, this progression pass makes it very easy. Um, what else do we get that I wanted? Oh, the demi hard toolbox. Cool. All right. Now, what do I need? Uh, I need a full set of accessories. So, necklace, ring, ring. I need a riding crop, belt, earring, earring. Ring, necklace, ring, riding crop, belt, earring, earring. Chew up there. I'm going to sort my inventory out. I guess I have pearl stuff. <laughs> um, adventure support box. No. You. Fantastic. Easy going. Cuckoo. We got a pet. And we got a little bit of pet food. Alright, so the other thing that I need... I want some training clothes. Just so I have some kind of armor to wear. Because this guy's gonna be AFK training until further notice. Cool. And I want some gathering clothes. Just because it gives me... Didn't it give me like a gathering level or something? 
Uh, am I blind? I hate the pop up on that. Yeah, it gives me movement speed. And no, it doesn't give me a level. It gives me um, mastery. So we need the gathering and the training. Training clothes can sit down there for now, but we do have the riding crop. That's going to give me extra speed. Uh, next thing I'm going to push for before I end this off, I need some artifacts. Uh, eventually, I want to buy the ones that give me energy recovery. I didn't... I mean, I haven't had a consistent leveling method yet. I think what the methods are going to be... For now, it's just gathering. Uh, gathering, horse training, and fishing. Until I can get enough silver uh, coming in that I can just buy AFK training books. Next, um... Next episode, we're going to focus on leveling, probably. Why is this blinking again? Cool, another Kaffir's. Kaffir's is fun. Uh, what's the blacksmith? So, I guess I could put on some uh, rebloth. That'll give me some more DP just running around than, than what I currently have. We're at 8 DP. That's not very good. <laughs> so I can do that. Uh, I want to get to where I have enough mastery. Because... For... We're at 32 life fame. I need more life levels. Uh, I need to unlock a second region. I need to go to Valencia. Let's put it that way. I need to go visit Valencia way the heck over here. So I'm going to need some... Uh, I'm going to need some DP gear to get over there. And I'm also going to need to be able to unlock another region. Uh, I got to go over there to get Rosar offhand. Either that or I got to buy him from the marketplace. But I want a DP offhand. Uh, that's probably going to be my in-game offhand is the Rosar. Because it gives evasion and DP. It's the highest I can find. I'll turn it into the ultimate version. Uh, I'm not doing any PvE stuff. I just need to survive, so I need as much DP as possible. So I'm going to be going for everything DP. Uh, we'll get a Black Star main hand. The, um, the Shy is kind of limited on the talent because it, it gets the, the special thing weapon for it. And then we can have a DP offhand. And that will, that'll get us where we need to be. Uh, if we turn that into an ultimate version, uh, probably go Narcs, and I don't know. We'll see. I've got to uh, unlock stuff first. So next episode, I'm gonna try and be pushing up to level ten. Uh, I may record these back to back, so you may see it immediately um, following, or I may just uh, do a collection. I think what I'll do is horse train for a bit, and then see where we're at. So. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the progress. I uh, hope this is exciting. Uh, it's fun to play. Like We're still at zero monsters defeated. Uh, 66 overall because of the tutorial stuff like I explained. If this is the first time seeing it, go watch the, go watch the introduction, episode zero. Um, but there's our progress so far. A lot of knowledge and karma. Uh, but we're making good progress. Uh, here's the map that we've unlocked. So we kind of unlocked a lot of Balanos just in in an hour of playing here and there. And uh, so I have my work cut out for me. I am ready to make progress. Let me go over the goals again. Uh, ultimately, I want to survive a red battlefield match without killing anybody. I want to I want to get a victory and survive and not die. Uh, pushing for soft cap level 62. And of course, everybody wants to do. Uh, 700 gear score in these challenges, so that's what we're pushing for. Soft cap level 62, uh, gear score 700, and survive bread battlefield without dying. So we need lots of DP and patience. <laughs> but this is how it's going to go. Uh, I'm going to be pushing for life skill stuff first uh, because I need I need a level. Um, 
being level 7, it's going to only get harder from there. So I'm going to need silver making methods. I'm going to need um, level level uh, making, experience making things. So it's going to be a lot of AFK stuff. I may end up being to a point where I'm buying materials at the marketplace and processing for XP. I mean, this could get crazy uh, in terms of, of what I got to do. But uh, for now, it's going to be horse training. So I'll set it up on the other other thing and, and let her go so have a good uh rest your day and as always until next time